Hello everyone, Sigma Later here, and welcome to Resident Evil 5. Yes, we are continuing our saga with Resident Evil 5. Now, full disclosure, this is my third attempt at recording this episode. My first attempt, I was recording it on PC, and I think there's an issue with Windows Live because... Most of the, of the footage was fine until it got to the end of the episode. I don't know what happened. It just completely crashed Premiere Pro and then crashed my computer. So there was some kind of corruption in the footage. I'm pretty sure it had something to do with Windows Live. Because as I came out of the game after finishing my recording, there was a big window saying that there was an issue with Windows Live. So I then tried to record it again on my PS4 and the game audio recorded twice on the same track. I was going to see if I could fix it somehow but I, I'm i not that knowledgeable on editing so I'm just going to re-record the episode. So with that in mind, we, let's go again. There we go, chapter one. Normal. Yep, no one can come in. Partner will not react to me shooting them. Right. Well, this is rather annoying because I was hoping for a playthrough without stuff, but I don't mind. I've already. As we're here, we might as well. I can buy a first aid spray, don't really need it. already got that. Oh, these upgrades can't afford any. That's fine. Alright, what can we organise? Right, let's give one of those to Sheva. You don't need that, so I'll have those. There we go. Let's get this semi-organised. Oh, another gun there, and a first aid spray. Oh, that's already in my inventory. Okay, that will do. Captain Deshant here. We secured the underground route to the coordinates. I should have seen it coming. It didn't take long after the fall of the Umbrella Corporation for their bioweapons to end up in the hands of terrorists. A new era of bioterrorism descended upon vulnerable countries, shifting the balance of power throughout the region. People in the destabilized areas soon feared another incident like Raccoon City was inevitable. As panic spread, governments of the world turned to the Global Pharmaceutical Consortium which formed the anti-terrorism unit, BSAA. Operatives of the BSAA were sent to infiltrate and neutralize bioterrorist hotspots, restoring safety and stability to various regions around the globe. Welcome to Africa. 
My name is Sheva Alamar. Chris Redfield. Your reputation precedes you, Mr. Redfield. It's an honor. Just Chris, thanks. So you'll be accompanying me to the destination? Yes. Tensions are running high ever since the change in government. I'll bet. Intel says it's a haven for terrorists now. And I'm not going to be happy to see an American, BSAA or not. That's why I'm your partner. Help put them at ease. Well, I'm sure you'll do just fine. Okay. Yeah, sorry. It's nothing. Let's go. Casualties continue to mount over the long years I've struggled. More and more, I find myself wondering if it's all worth fighting for. Maybe one day, I'll find out. Hey, hey! Who you intending? Alafanya nini hapa? You don't have to get touchy. Let's go. There is one thing I do know. I have a job to do, and I'm gonna see it through. Should be somewhat reused to the controls by now. I don't play five and six all that often. Well, hardly ever, if at all, because I'm just not that keen on them. But then again, I wasn't that keen on Revelations. Chris, Sheva, can you read me? Chris here, coming in loud and clear, Kirk. Yes, we read you. There's a black market weapons deal going down in Kijuju. That's where Irving will be. Alpha team has already infiltrated the area, and you will be going in as backup. Rendezvous with your contact at the butcher's shop. You can gear up and get briefed on the mission there. Watch your backs. Roger that. Copy. Over now. Okay. I didn't enjoy Revelations when that first came out, but the last playthrough I did, I actually really enjoyed it. So it'll be interesting to revisit 5 and 6 again. Although... I'm less looking forward to 6 because I flat out hated 6 when I first played it. But we'll see how this goes because I want to re-immerse re myself in the lore. That's why I've been doing this saga series. So when I revisit Resident Evil games, it's prim it's primarily 1, 2, 3, 4 and Code Veronica. Those are the ones I will mainly go back to. And I'll tend to ignore 5 and 6. And the Revelations games. But we'll see if this helps change my mind. Ah, Chris Redfield. Go around to the side door. Chris, this way. But you're, you're in the way, Sheva. Oh my god, are you actually being serious? Really, Sheva, you didn't do this last time. Oh my god. <sighs> What's up, fella? I 
have your weapon for you here. Jethan. Will do, thanks. I can tell already you are going to get on my nerves. Did you just seriously... Sheva! Destination coordinates? Found squares up ahead. Go through there. Alpha team's waiting at the deal location. Good. What do you know about Uroboros? Mostly just rumors. Something about visions of a doomsday project. Doomsday sounds about right, but apparently it is no rumor. You're kidding, right? You must find a man named Irving. He is our only lead. And be careful out there. Thanks, you too. Right, Sheva, we need to have words. You, right. You are no longer in charge of health. When your life gauge is fully depleted due to taking damage, your status will change to dying. If this status is displayed for your partner, you can revive him or her by pressing circle while nearby. You cannot revive yourself in this state. The game will end if your partner is unable to assist you before time runs out or if you or if both of you both you and your partner are in the dying state at the same time. Cool. Control types. Uh use R2 square to fire. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave it as uh, as the default. I don't like this camera control at all. Not going that way. We're going this way. Remember, we're a team. Whatever happens, we stick together. Don't worry. I may not be as big as you, but I can still hold my I believe it. Oh, lovely. Hi, machete man. Body's still warm. Why is this here? I imagine it's a kind of warning, Chris. There's an animal carcass on the table. Is it for some ceremony? Maybe. I'll collect all the money. The writing is erratic. All outsiders will receive the blade of punishment. We will bless them with a sacred death. We will release them from their bonds of wickedness. Hey, I like my bonds of wickedness. My health was a bit low, so maybe I overreacted to you before, Sheva, but... Did you hear that? It came from that building. So warning prior to you making those decisions would be helpful. Freeze! 
Death Punch. What the hell just happened? They didn't move like any zombies I've ever seen. No, they didn't. Smash the TV. So, Sheva, my need for ammo is greater. They've already found us. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Come in, Kirk. The locals were hostile and we had to use force. We don't have any contingency plans for this situation, do we, Kirk? Roger on the locals. Does that mean? Was HQ expecting this? More than likely. Two people could kick this door in. Is this where I think it is? What's going on here? Oh god. Yeah, we've read that already. It's a giant hex. Don't think it's being used on trees. No. More moolah, thank you. Lovely. You've got plenty of ammo, don't look at me like that. You grab it. Okay. There we go, see? It's all about the teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Wish these guys had subtitles. Much like Resident Evil 4, I have no idea what the enemies are saying. You do that one, I'll do this one. I got this. Yeah, I've got plenty of ammo this time at least. Come on, you grab this. Another grenade, thank you. Right, we're good to go.
I got ya. You don't need the machine gun. Yeah, so do I. No! Why did I... I didn't want to give you the grenades! I wanted to use them! Pressing all the wrong buttons. Are you okay? No. You've got the grenades I want. Can I have those grenades back, please, Sheva? Oh, I keep pressing the wrong damn button. Oh, fuck. This being hit. Whoa, hello. God, these controls are awful. Did you grab it? Good, you did grab it. Let's just keep running. Whoa, hey, big fella. I didn't want to do that. I went up there for a reason. Yes.
That's all right. Oh, thank God for that. God, that was... All three times I've recorded this episode, it's gone just as badly. But giving Shevin the grenades... It's not a mistake I made before. I'm just pressing all the wrong buttons. That's one way to open a door, I suppose. Ugh. And somehow I still got an S rank. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, it should be obvious after that that this game has been neglected by me for quite some time. As my skill is non-existent. But for now I'm going to end this episode here because I'm paranoid about the uh, of the footage. So, thank you very much for taking the time to watch this guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later, this has been Resident Evil 5, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.